it's really good as well. It's lots of bonus. It's, uh, it's 5 30 in the morning. I'm trying to get a little bit more sleep and I'm going to take a shower. So. Anti-pasty selection out while I went to go get water and this bastard seagull fucking go into it. So that's probably not safe to eat now. I mean I don't really want to eat it. What the fuck? You absolute twat. The oldest and the tomatoes are sealed separately and that was expensive, so I'm eating it anyway. Breakfast, making some tea, drying my towels, Trixie. A very nice view. What more could you want? My milk's gone bad, so I can't actually have tea. my cheese. You're welcome. <laughs> Bye. Oh. <laughs> Petra is almost a normal price up here. Wow. We got here by accident. be like various viewpoints where it stops. On a pool. I've just had a cup of tea and a little pub. I haven't had anything to eat yet because nowhere seems to be serving food. I've not looked that hard but there's, there's no food. So I could walk to this petrol station and look for a sandwich or something. I don't know. Pardon me, let's do that. Whatever the fuck a scotch pie is. Just pie shaped sausage roll. Alright, breakfast over. Let's go. I love the beauty spot. Taking the west coast and we're doing like a bit of a down. That made no sense. That's what we're doing. It's very pretty. I'm surrounded by mountains. There's one. That's Ben A or eight. Uh, ben something. And then we've got more. Boom. Stopped at a pretty castle. Mm -hmm. I like the campsite. It's rained pretty much all day. Um, it's raining now. Thankfully, I managed to get my tent up in like a gap between raining and also raining. So, here's our little. 
here's our little home. Um, I managed to keep my rocket kit dry by wearing this over it because I'm using my rocket kit as a pillow. So that's in the tent. Um, I need to figure out what I'm going to do for food. I don't know if there's any food where we are. I don't really want to go back out again. It's pissing it down. I'm sick of riding in the rain. We've had a great day. Like, all the stuff that we've seen. So much stuff. Not really gone around any corners though. My very lovely new tyres. Yeah, it's just fucking chucked it down all day, but it's been beautiful. We've seen so much cool stuff. Oh my god, it really is raining. What am I supposed to do now? I'm just gonna sit in the tent in my wet kit. Fuck. I need to take these trousers off before they get wet. Right. We're doing it. We're getting changed in the corner. I love my new tent, but it is absolutely useless for this all weather. It's not big enough when you've got to deal with wet crap and dry crap and it's like nigh on impossible to take knee length boots off in here um i've been doing it outside because it hasn't rained up until now and it's pissing it down it's like the worst all right let's try and find food so i've barely eaten anything today um, I actually threw most of that scotch pie away because there was something weird in it that I threw it away. Um, and I've got no food, and even if I did have food, I don't think I'd be able to cook it because I'd have to sit outside and it's it's raining. And much as I love my little tent, it is a summer tent. There's nowhere sheltered that you can actually sit up and do stuff in. As I've just found out, I can barely take shoes off inside the tent, so... I'm walking out the campsite to one of the two hotels that's here that has like a restaurant attached to it and I'm going to do something I really really don't want to do which is sit in a restaurant on my own and have a table for one. I can't think of anything more depressing. I know people are like, oh if you can go to the cinema and go to a restaurant by yourself you're really powerful. I can't think of anything worse. Like, it makes me so sad. <laughs> and even though I'll just sit outside and eat on my own, that's not a problem. It's just something about sitting in a restaurant and everyone's looking at you and you're on your own. I don't like that shit. But I'm so hungry, so I'm doing it anyway. This is one of those times where if I had someone with me, I wouldn't feel quite so sad. There's no one. <laughs> this food better be good. Oh my god, I need this. I'm so hungry. I did it. I fed myself. Oh god. Um, and that was just really uncomfortable, but at least I'm not hungry. Um, and it was nice to be inside for a little bit. I wasn't the only person there eating on their own either. There was two men that both were on their own. One of them was a motorcyclist. And I think normally in motorcycle culture, you're supposed to like talk to each other, but I wasn't wearing anything that like identifies me as a motorcyclist. So I thought it'd probably be weird to just turn around and be like, what are you on, bruv? <laughs> um, so I did not do that. His food looked way nicer than mine though. I had a burger, it was okay. I'm eating out of necessity, not really because I want to eat. Um, I mean, I do want to eat, but I don't really want to eat a burger, but there wasn't really anything on the menu that I fancied. They were putting haggis on everything. I was like, meat freeze pizza has haggis on it. I know we're in Scotland, but you don't put a haggis on pizza, surely. Anyway, that's like a personal milestone completed. Bit of a weird one, but I... We're walking back to the campsite, but we'll do like a, um... Like a bit of a... An evening wander around. We're near Ben Nevis, I didn't even realise. I think 
think I'm just in like an overflow field to the campsite. That's a big hill. Behind these trees is a big hill. Could be a mountain. There's a rabbit. This is a pathway? Does this go somewhere? What does this danger sign say? What do we got? Oh, water. Okay. We found adventure. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, we, we go, we go under. <laughs> oh my fucking god. <laughs> Ow, frick. My ankle is not good enough for this sort of thing. <laughs> this should keep me busy for a little while. Oh my god, I found a frog. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at him! Is that something? Oh, what the hell? Hello! Can't be free. I'm gonna leave this area because now I'm thinking I'm probably stepping on them because there's so many. I feel blessed. I reckon I'll just go back to my tent while it's not raining. And I'm full of food. I'm just gonna try and get to sleep. Oh my god, a bed. <laughs> that concludes day five. I think we're on day five. Time is now meaningless to me. Today's been quite testing, to be honest. Um, more testing than yesterday. Yesterday was just funny. Today's been quite tiring. I am exhausted at the end of each day that I do, which is nice in a way. It feels like I've accomplished something because I'm tired, but now I'm just a bit bored of being tired. The bike's been flawless, though. Like, it's been amazing. It's so comfortable. And in the rain, it's been perfect it's been so good so tomorrow's gonna be a bit boring like we're gonna have the last of the good roads and then we're gonna hit the motorway um and just start heading south so yay.